says, uh, why'd you do all that? The other golfer said, well, out of respect. She gave me 40 of the best years of her life. <laughs> This is our golf course, and um, we all, out of respect, both mourn the passing of and celebrate the life of Charles Ryan Rye Rye Roach, <laughs> a man through who his through his immense talent his sense of humor, his bear hugs, and his great heart have, uh, he's given all of us some of the best years of our lives. I gotta say, the next time we are all gathered here today, it had better be for Jonathan Bragg and Emily Ford's wedding. <laughs> on the interwebs, can you do it? No pressure, but before the end of the service, we want a proposal and acceptance. <laughs> so, uh, of course, they, they kindly asked me to do this, and I immediately accepted, and, and honored to do it. And, uh, but I was thinking, you know, what am I going to, uh, what am I going to say? Do I need to write some stuff down, do I just wing it, what do I do, and so I uh, got in touch with uh, Allison Tolman, who I co-hosted Broadway Our Way with a few years ago, and uh, you know, Allison, uh, what, do I, what do I say, what do I do, and she simply said, keep your pants on. <laughs> <laughs> Comedian likes nothing more than to kick you square in the balls. When you just don't. <laughs> okay, we have a lot of speakers here today. Uh, a lot of singing, a lot of celebrating. Um, all in Ryan's name, of course. So we're going to get started with that. But uh, real quickly, I want to tell you a quick story about one of the greatest events of the 21st century, and that is. The last Harry Potter film. <laughs> <laughs> Which I attended with Brian Rhodes. 
some friends. And what we did was we basically um, we got together at Beth Albright's house before the movie. And to be honest with you, I think he had already seen the movie like 13 times. <laughs> So anyway, you know, uh, so I show up at Beth's and, and uh, there's a few people there and they're kind of, kind of in costume, kind of not, you know, it's like robe and jeans or you know, some glasses or a little bra or whatever. <laughs> I should preface it by saying I have not read one letter or one sentence of one page of one book of that thing. Okay. <laughs> I, I, I was just all about the movie and I just wanted to know two things. Is Spider-Man in it? And what are they going to do about Emma's boobs? That's all that I needed to know. So I show up and we're, you know, we're having fun and everything. More people show up, and then Ryan shows up. <laughs> Playing the part, talking the talk, walking the walk, the whole bit, head to toe. That, and uh, so. A lot of these folks that are at the party are really getting into this. Um, so they're all speaking Harry Potter talk, and they're whipping out wands and casting spells on one another. I'm in the corner eating a cookie. And then finally they say, let's play Harry Potter trivia. Yes! And they get the magic hat that talks, the little puppet or whatever. All the, you know, we split up into teams, you know, and I'm team Flask or Flask or whatever it is. And, um, the funny part was, though, that, you know, we were split up into like four teams or whatever, but it very quickly turned into Ryan Roach against everyone. Of course it did. And he was just kicking their ass. He knew every line every character in the book, he knew the names, he knew what they said, and everything. I mean, because we were doing this Harry Potter trivia, and we would just start with like a preposition. <laughs> we would start a lot. And so, oh, 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 oh yeah, that's uh, Hilda Twinklebottom in Harry Potter travels to Ikea or whatever. <laughs> Then we go to the movie, and uh, he is really enjoying it. He's, he's emoting, and he's, I hope it, I mean, almost to the point where kids are like, Sir, are you okay? <laughs> 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 oh, once again, thank you so much uh, for being here. It's an honor to, to, uh, to be here as well. And let's, uh, let's get started. Our first speaker is uh, Leah Patton. <laughs> 